Okay, everyone, we are back playing more of this mini thief game, me and Rambo145. We played it a little bit before we started recording, so then that way we could be able to get the safe, because that's what we was trying for in the last one. So we finally got enough money, we was able to get the safe. So then this way, if we got busted, we wouldn't lose our money and stuff. We also bought a chew toy right here, because now that we have the safe, we're going to try the third house and see if we can beat it and be able to unlock some different places. I know the first the first house and the second house, they're a lot more easier, but we don't get near as much money. And right here, we put the chew toy out, but right, af right at the bat, we got busted. We hadn't played the third one for a while. I mean, we bought the chew toy, but... I didn't know where the dog was and I guess he came out of the kitchen at first it took it a little bit to figure out why we had got caught but we put the chew toy down but I guess the dog came to us quicker so we came back in here trying to figure out what had happened with the safe what happened with our money if we had to buy another safe if it was just a one-time thing we figured out that the safe doesn't save our money it just saves our tools which is fine too because then we don't have to rebuy them because you know we lose all our money we wouldn't have the money to buy the toys and the the little cutter things so we came back here to the first house so that way we could get a little bit of money built up so we could buy another chew toy because otherwise we wouldn't be able to go through the third one we'd end up getting caught again like we did before Okay, we're back in the third house again. We have the chew toy. We was lucky enough to be able to get it out before the dog got us. We have to watch for the cameras. There was the little red trip wire. Um, I had went up and was going to try to snip that thing. And I ended up just shutting off my flashlight. So it was kind of hard to do it in the dark. I had to keep turning the flashlight back on. Um, there was a camera down at the bottom. There's a camera at the top of the stairs that you have to watch for. So, this time we was, you know, we should be able to get out of it. We got the thing up top unlocked. Once you get it unlocked, then you go out the window. And then we'll be able to go to another, another place. So, it seemed like this time, I don't know why, but the owners, they was coming back a lot faster. I guess the further you get along, the faster they come home. I'm not sure. But we got past that one. We unlocked a couple of achievements, so now we'll be able to advance on to the medium house, which I'm sure will be a little bit more harder and harder to do, but the more we do, the further we go, the newer places that we get to unlock.
Okay, now we're going to try the third house on the medium houses and see what, how well we can do on it. Each one gets a little harder. They have more security traps. They have, like, the dog there that got us this time. So, anyway, I'll let you continue to watch the rest of it. I think we end up getting busted a couple other times at the end. I know we play it and record it and then we talk over it because it's a lot easier for us that way. So, if you want to see Rambo145's edit and talking on the video, I'll put the link in the description and you can see his, his take on it. So, anyway, I'll let you watch the rest of it and hope you enjoy it. Stick around for more. Like, share, subscribe, you know, keep watching for more videos. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you. 